Hello. This is Mike. No stress, Mike.com. And uh, I just wanted you to, uh, wanted to mention something. Uh, I'm in the hills of uh, the Ozarks, and uh, I'm just all kinds of uh, out in the sticks. And, um, but anyway, um, I've noticed uh, that, you know, there's uh, different parts of the country you're in, it's a little different. Uh, people a little different, the uh, roads. When I say, look at these roads. <laughs> you know, I mean, this is, this is really weird. Uh, windy roads and, you know, I say we're out in the middle of nowhere. But um, one thing that it all has in common, pretty much, uh, here in the United States, is uh, it's civilized. And the thing that made me start thinking about that, I thought, well, because why do the American people put up with stuff? And um, the thing is, uh, we've been civilized, and I, I was, and some of it is, uh, well, a lot of it is being dumbed down. And the, the reason you can be dumbed down is because everything is so easy. Uh, I've always said that in the United States, it's kind of like Disneyland, you know what I mean? Everything is, the roads are all marked, uh, and like here, they got addresses. And I was thinking, boy, how do they do the addresses out here, you know, so. But they've had a lot of time to slowly get things right where it's uh, easy to, do things. Like I say, I was, I've been in Central America, man, they don't even have addresses. Some places don't have any addresses at all, and one address for a whole bunch of different places, you know, I mean, is really strange. And, um, but here, uh, like I say, everything is in order. That's because they're civilized. And once it's in order, everybody understands everything. This is what you're doing. You're learning how everything works. That's how uh, the United States runs. Is uh, everything is smooth acting, and uh, you know where you can go and where you can't go. You know one-way streets, and and uh, you know, uh, and in time. When you're in the city, you learn uh, what neighborhoods you you avoid. You know, I mean, matter of fact, they made it kind of easy for you because they'll put a highway that goes around uh, a neighborhood, and uh, because they don't want you driving down that neighborhood. So, and this is what makes everything civilized. And then when you don't go down in that neighborhood you don't realize it you avoid it as long as they do their stuff in that neighborhood well hey you don't care what they do and uh, so uh, that's where you know what you're learning is how to be civilized and that's that's okay and it's really good to a point. But I'm thinking that point, we've passed that point. And be civilized, you know, you know, we have a, uh, they're gonna be a meeting, a town meeting, you know, we want everybody to be civilized when you're in there. You know, no cussing, no raising your voice, no, you know, none of this kind of stuff. We'll call security, you know. And in which, in the old days, when they weren't quite so civilized, they didn't call security. They punch them out. And this is uh, this is the way it was when I was young. 
being brought up. And the older people, even when they were young, it was even more uh, proven a point by punching somebody in the face. You know, I, one of the things I think is funny is on uh, January 6th, you know, they uh, the politicians were making a big deal about, well, we won't be intimidated. We'll, we're going to do all this stuff. They missed the point. You know, uh, the people were there to exercise their right to be displeased. And then some uh, went inside and like I say, they took it, uh, this, this is what I think is funny, they took it as a politician, I tell you how, how lame they are. Uh, they didn't take it like, man, those people are displeased. No, <laughs> they didn't take it like that. <laughs> you know, and did they do anything? This is the part that I think is funny. Did they do anything? Yeah, called security. These people, you want to call them civilized? I, I don't know if I would call them civilized. Uh, when somebody has to call security and because people are displeased, you know, I, it's, how come they're not taking it like people are mad? They're upset. Why? Why aren't they taking this? And the thing is, as long as somebody else will get their hands dirty, you can be civilized. You know, being civilized is easy when somebody else has to do all the dirty work. And um, this is part of taking personal responsibility. Uh, you need to uh, realize that uh, we may be to the end of our civilization. Uh, there, you know, I think it's funny. Now they're running a bill uh, for the guns. Uh, they want to start limit guns. You know, these people, they're not, they're not, they're so civilized, so used to calling somebody else to do their dirty work. They don't understand what the guns is all about. Well, they understand how the guns can hurt them. That's why they want to get rid of the guns. But they don't understand that that's how this nation started, was strong individuals. Strong individuals, they weren't civilized. They weren't civilized individuals. They were individuals. They had to make civilization from what they had to work with. And then when you get to the point where you're so civilized that you think you can push people around, then you have a problem. That's why uh, the, the guns thing is, uh, yeah, uh, it keeps the government straight, yes. But what it really does is it keeps us as individuals safe because we don't call security. That's why they want to get you to call 911, you know. You're, you're, you're too weak and wimpy to handle it yourself, you know, when all you need is a backbone and a gun. And a lot of stuff can be settled. And uh, you don't even need to get to the violence. You just, but you need to have a way to express your displeasure on what's going on and uh but i think it's it's funny because like i say they're, they're getting robbed so i want to call 911 <laughs> you know that's why i say when i was in a robbery they we called 911 after they were already laying down on the floor i mean they, that's when you call 911 and because they're just going to make a report they don't stop anything it's that sense of security that wimps have calling security 911 this is mike no stress mike .com.